My name is Amrita and I'm a research fellow at the Institute of Development Studies. I work across the business markets and states and the rural futures cluster at IDS. I'm an economist and my work focuses on political economy and development. I specialize in the political economy of international trade, agricultural policy, innovation and gender. I have done work on trade policy, looking at interactions between businesses and governments and how that shapes different trade policy outcomes such as tariffs, non-tariff barriers, etc. And much of my work has focused on India, the UK, Africa, as well as on South-South and triangular cooperation for trade and investments. My current research includes work that I'm doing on UK-India trade, funded by the Economic and Social Research Council of the UK. Now, the UK and India share a long history, but have also emerged as strong bilateral partners in recent times. As new opportunities spring up from digitalization, for collaboration in healthcare, and as a result of geopolitical shifts, there are going to be some mutually beneficial opportunities. So we want to unpack the micro level effects of these, identifying the more inclusive trade opportunities on both ends. My research is aimed at understanding the political economy processes and the incentives that stimulate or hamper specific trade policy outcomes. Trade policy involves policymakers, uh, the private sector, and also consumers. So there are a lot of different actors and specific negotiations such as a free trade agreement or a crisis such as the current pandemic shines a light on countries trade such as what we are seeing now for vaccines. So getting a handle on what is at stake during such events requires a better understanding of the incentives towards trade policy, its determinants, and importantly, potential effects on development outcomes. It is well accepted that there are gains from trade, but these are not evenly distributed. International trade creates both winners and losers. And that's why through my work, I aim to inform the framing of a more inclusive trade lens in practice.